It's that time of year again. It's mosquito season. I'm Dahlia Ashley in Victoria Park, and here we are again this summer, a rainy day. And with the rain comes more mosquitoes. And if you're anything like me and allergic to mosquitoes, you probably do a lot of this. But a recent study shows if you play this, it will beat the mosquitoes away. You don't have to put on the red light. While Sting won't put the red lights on mosquitoes stinging you, this might. Are the mosquitoes still around you? I can't tell. Do you want to take a look around you? Ooh, Actually, I can't see any right now. Did you notice that the mosquitoes, the mosquitoes kind of left us? Yeah, I think so. Are the mosquitoes still around you? <laughs> no, they're not. <laughs> and some were just confused. While our tests are unscientific, a team of international scientists specializing in mosquitoes found that playing this track by Skrillex is a buzzkill. The scientists found mosquitoes exposed to the song had sex less often, meaning entertained female adult mosquitoes by people less in a dubstep environment, meaning playing music with low frequency vibrations, in other words, slow tunes, gets them in the mood, more sex, which means more mosquito bites for us. That's a wonderful trade-off. The less chemicals to use, I think, is better. And if dubstep can do it, like, let's 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 use dubstep everywhere. And for some, it's solibo musical taste. I'd rather use the off. T at least the taste goes away pretty quickly. From Edmonton, Dahlia Ashry, City News.